Hey guys, it's Morgo and welcome back to my channel. Well, today I am checking out this beautiful marble accessories that you could use for your bath salts or anything like that for your bathroom. So I was checking out Jaclyn Hill's bathroom tour the other day and she used these beautiful marble canisters that she got from Pottery Born. So when I looked at the price, I'm like, there's no way I could spend this much money. So I figured, why not do a hack? So I'm going to show you how to do this bathroom hack for your accessories for your bathroom that looks like marble. All right, guys, let's get started. So I'm going to start off using some old bath and body candles. These are empty now and I have used these before. So I figure I can just use these to hold like my bathroom salts or if you have any Epsom or something like that. All right, so what I'm going to do is use acrylic paint, and I'm using four colors. I'm using an iridescent, a gray, a black, and I also have a white. And you want to also use a sealant. I'm using a clear spray. You can use Mod Podge as well. Now here, I'm also using a mat because it's going to be very drippy, so you want to either use a mat or a plate. Now also, you want to have a cup just to water down your paint and one to mix it. My alcohol here is just to clean the surface off to make sure the paint can adhere to it. Now, if you don't have any old bath and body candles, you can also use it in any type of container. This jars I got from Hobby Lobby for a few dollars. And the first thing you want to do is cover your design with paint. So you want to prime it because you don't want the pattern to see through the design. When mixing your paint, you want to make sure it has a light consistency to it. It's kind of watered down, but you don't want it too watery. So I'm going to show you real quickly how I'm going to do this Art Deco. This is regular Art Deco you can get from Michael's, any craft store. And this is going to be a pearl white. Again, you can use any colors that you want, but I'm just going to show you how I'm going to add just a little bit of water, mix it with it, and stir it up. And it's as simple as can be. All right, guys, you don't want it too watery again, but you don't want it thick because it has to flow consistently over the cup. Make the marble effect i'm using colors like white black silver and iridescent now if you want a light marble you use predominantly more white if you want it darker it's more gray but i only want to have a specks of black so what i'm going to do here is start with the iridescent then the white the black and gray and then you just repeat the layers over and over again this is called a dirty pour Okay, guys, once everything is mixed together, the only thing you have to do is pour it over the jars and the magic happens. It'll make its own designs and look how this beautiful marble effect came out. See how simple this is with just acrylic paint and water. That's all it took. Now, I like to use these clear bumpers I got from Home Depot. And basically, I'm just putting them on the bottom. And this is just optional, just so it can protect the bottom of the jar, just in case when you move things from back and forth from tub to sink, it won't scratch the bottom. So these things will be really convenient to use. And again, they're very affordable. And another thing I like to do is add some type of edging. And again, this is optional just to give it a little gold or silver look to it. So I'm using these Cryline pens or you can get them from Craftsmarts. It's sort of like a liquid silver and a liquid gold. And I think this makes beautiful embellishment to the edging of your jars. Okay, guys, it's the end of this video. All right, guys, let me know if there's something that you would like to try. Again, it's so simple. It's just craft paint and water. Pour it over your jars and make a beautiful design. Please stay to the end so you can see the other projects I've been doing for the past two weeks. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram or TikTok. On Instagram, real time, I show you the many projects I've been doing over the week. All right, guys, it's your girl. And don't forget to like, comment, and share. I'll see you at the next videos. All right, guys, it's your more girl. Shifting shapes in